good morning my dear student today we will see the spinel structure in detail as we know the metal oxides form the two type of the structure that is the spinel structure spinel structure and second type of the structure formed by the metal oxide is a corundum structure corundum structure today we will see details about the spinel structure what is mean by spinel spinel are the compounds which having the two different type of the cations one is the divalent and the second is trivalent along with the oxide okay so first we will write the definition of the spinel spinel are the compounds which have two different cations one is divalent we write in general as a a2 plus and second is the b plus 3 type and oxide that is o2 minus as the anion as the anion okay. from this we can write the general formula general formula as a plus 2 b plus 3 twice and o4 to minus or we can write it as uh, a b 2 o 4 a b 2 o 4 okay so spinel structure again are of two type one is the normal spinel structure and second is the inverse spinel structure question asked on this topic is like the compound is given and we have to determine or we have to Uh, identify which is the inverse spinel structure and which is the normal spinel structure okay so seeing details the normal spinel structure so spinel structure are of two type one is the normal spinel structure and second is the inverse spinel structure normal spinel structure and inverse spinel structure so let us see in details the normal spinel structure as we know the anions form the Uh, packing in the crystal lattice and whatever the voids present whatever the empty space present in between the sphere of the anion that is accumulated by the cations in case of the ionic compound right so in case of the normal spinel structure we have to remember how much amount of the tetrahedral voids is accumulated by the divalent cation and how much amount of the octahedral voids accommodated by the b plus 3 anion and from that we can determine the type of the spinel structure so uh, first see in details the normal spinel structure normal spinel structure mein jo anion se o2 minus anions o2 minus forms the fcc packing O2 minus anions forms FCC packing. और उसमें क्या होता है जो वन एट्थ पोर्शन जो होता है टेट्राहाइड्रल वाइड्स का हमें पता है टेट्राहाइड्रल एंड द ऑक्टाहाइड्रल वाइड्स प्रेजेंट होते हैं उनमें से जो 
टेट्राहाइड्रल वॉइड से उसका वन एट पोर्शन जो है वो ए टू प्लस कटाइन अकोमरेट करता है वन एट ऑफ टेट्राहाइड्रल वॉइड वॉइड आर अकूफाइड बाय डायवेलेंट दैट इज ए टू प्लस कटाइन राइट देन एंड वन हाफ ऑफ ऑक्टाहाइड्रल वॉइड्स आर अकूपाइड बाय ट्राइवेलेंट कटाइन Occupied by trivalent that is B plus थ्री cations right ये दो sentence हमें याद रखने to determine the normal spinel or inverse spinels तो हम determine करते हैं कि per cations जैसे हमें पता है पहले कि sorry per anions per anions two tetrahedral voids present होते हैं and one octahedral void present होता है जैसे हमने last लेक्चर में ये देखा है ये भी बात हमें याद रखनी है टू सॉल्व द क्वेश्चंस ऑन दिस टॉपिक तो चलो हम डिटरमाइन करते हैं पर अनायंस कितने कटाइंस प्रेजेंट हो सकते हैं और कितने सॉरी कितने डायवेलेंट कटाइंस प्रेजेंट हो सकते हैं और कितने ट्राइवेलेंट कटाइंस प्रेजेंट हो सकते हैं सो फॉर वन अनायन That is for one oxide. Number of number of A two plus cation number of A two plus cation is equal to right. ये one half portion sorry one eight portion accumulate करते हैं tetrahedral voids का tetrahedral voids present होते हैं two per each anion. So टोटल जो नंबर ऑफ ए टू प्लस कटाइन से वो है वन बाय फोर राइट सेकेंड इज द नंबर ऑफ बी प्लस टू कटाइंस वो अकोमडेट होते हैं ऑक्टाहाइड्रल वॉइड्स में और वो भी हाफ अकोमडेट होते हैं और ओनली वन ऑक्टाहाइड्रल वॉइड इज प्रेजेंट पर अनायन एंड दैट्स वाई वन हाफ इज द नंबर ऑफ ए टू प्लस एंड बी प्लस थ्री राइट एंड फ्रॉम दिस वी कैन राइट अ रेशो ऑफ द डायवेलेंट बायवेलेंट एंड द अनायन रेशो दैट इज इफ यू ट्राई टू राइट द रेशो देन वन डायवेलेंट कटाइन एस टू सॉरी वन फोर्थ डायवेलेंट कटाइन एस टू वन हाफ ट्राइवेलेंट कटाइन एस टू वन अनायन दैट इज ऑक्साइड Ion. And from this, we can write the general formula. Even general formula, if you try to write, then the general formula as the a two plus one four, then b plus three one half and o two minus. Right? We can convert these uh, fraction number. That is one one by four b one half into the whole number. And from that, we can write the molecular formula. जनरल फॉर्मूला एज इफ वी मल्टीप्लाई इट बाय फोर देन वी गेट द ए बी टू ओ फोर इफ वी मल्टीप्लाई दिस फॉर्मूला बाय फोर देन वी गेट द ए बी टू ओ फोर एंड दिस इज द जनरल फॉर्मूला ऑफ द स्पिनेल राइट एंड फ्रॉम दिट वी कैन से दैट इट इज द नॉर्मल स्पिनल नॉर्मल स्पिनल हम किससे डिटरमाइन करेंगे द नंबर ऑफ कटाइंस एंड नंबर ऑफ अनायंस अकोमोडेटेड इन द क्रिस्टल स्ट्रक्चर सेकेंड इज द इनवर्स स्पिनल एज लाइक द नॉर्मल स्पिनल इनवर्स स्पिनल्स में भी जो अनायंस है वो एफ सी सी पैकिंग्स देते हैं इनवर्स स्पिनल्स में भी अनायंस फॉर्म अनायंस दैट इज ऑक्साइड 
forms face centered cubic packing closed packing and in closed packing two types of the voids present that is tetrahedral voids and octahedral voids the jo divalent cation hai wo one eighth of the tetrahedral voids accumulate karta hai same as the same as the normal spinel right so one eighth of the tetrahedral voids are occupied by divalent cation that is a2 plus okay while the trivalent uh, uh, ion that is b plus 3 okay a plus 2 accommodate the 1/8 while b plus 3 ion accommodate 1/8 of the tetrahedral voids 1/8 of the tetrahedral voids plus 1/4 of octahedral voids tetrahedral voids okay and from this we can determine the amount of divalent cation and means number of divalent cation and the number of trivalent cation present per each anion okay therefore for 1 anion that is o2 minus number of a plus 2 cations is equals to 1/8 into 2 because we know per anions the tetrahedral voids present is equals to 2 so it will be the 1 by 4 a plus 2 cations okay then the number of b plus 3 cation is equals to 1/8 into the tetrahedral voids the number of tetrahedral voids is equal to 2 plus 1/4 into the number of octahedral voids and number of octahedral voids is equal to 1 per anion so whole it gives the uh, it is 1 by 4 plus 1 by 4 and is equal to get the 2 by 4 is equal to 1 by 2 of the b plus 3 cation this is the number of okay then from this we can write the uh, ratio between the two types of the cations and anions as the 1/4 a plus 2 as to One half B plus three as to one anion that is oxide. Okay, and from that we can write the general formula. Okay. Then general formula A one by four B one half. o right and this general formula we can convert it into the whole number that is the a b2 o4 this is the spinel structural formula right and in this way we can determine the normal spinel and the inverse spinel we will more uh, clear while uh, solving the examples on this topic what is we have to remember the a combination of the voids while studying the inverse spinel and the normal spinel thank you if you like my video then please share it subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so whenever i add the new video you will get the notification thank you thank you so much